Hey guys, this is Jessica. We're here checking out Gigantic with Joe. Joe, what is your title here? I'm the lead character artist. Awesome. Can you tell us a little bit about this game? I have never seen anything about this game until I think like six months ago. I saw a little thing on YouTube, and it was the animation you guys had. It was awesome. It caught my eyes. Yeah, the little trailer. It was awesome. Tell us a little about Gigantic, maybe some of the story. Sure. sure. Characters. Uh, yeah, so uh, Gigantic is a five on five team action game, so PvP only. Um, your ultimate objective is to kill the enemies five-story tall uh, boss monster, basically, the Guardian. Um, you have one yourself, and so it's a, a process of, of getting him to attack the other Titan, and you actually getting some attacks on it and doing some damage. Um, it is kits similar to a, a MOBA. The characters all have very distinct uh, sets of skills and abilities, um, all kind of intending to encourage certain play styles. Um, yeah, I mean, it's a general... Over yeah, the so games. healers, tanks, yep. all that kind of stuff. Yep. Cool beans. Do you guys have an idea of how many characters are going to be at launch? Uh, yeah, right now we've we've got, I think, 16 are on the build that you just played. Um, internally, we have something like 25 or 26. Um, I would I would say it's it's less than that number that will launch at the end of the year, but uh, more than the number we have. It's 20-ish, yeah. question mark. Okay. Um, obviously, we'll be releasing more as we go. Uh, it's sort of sort of the name of the game is releasing different characters that sort of fit play styles for different types of people. So, uh, which character did you play? Uh -huh. So first I played the uh, tank, the the big guy yeah. with the big yeah yeah, and then uh, I played the healer, and both were very hard for me to play. I was I always get really nervous when devs are standing right behind me watching me play and giving me hints because I get like I just get scared. Yeah, secret: the people that were behind you are all our friends that are in our community. They're they're wearing the same shirts. But if you see the back, it says community still, coach. Still terrifying. Yeah, still tough. terrifying. And they would beat you into the ground uh, if yeah, they played. Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. Like, like I'll, I'll recommend League, but I won't recommend Gigantics. First time playing, everything. But um, I know it's for PC, obviously, and yep. now Xbox One you guys have yep. just announced. True. Um, is this going to be a game, or uh, is it going to be free to play? Or? Free to play. Free to play. Yep. Awesome. Very cool. Um, boop, boop, boop. So you'll release more characters and stuff as time yeah, goes so on. Maps. Creatures, maps, characters. How many maps are going to be available, uh, do you think? We have two right now. Okay. Um, the two we have right now, uh, one is the one you played, the canyon, mm -hmm. which is more about kind of a down the middle, you're always in a fight when you start. Kind of like um, it's, it's similar, right? It's, it's like a pressure cooker. that yeah, yeah. You don't really get to choose to not be in a fight so much. Mm -hmm. um, our other map is much bigger, and it's more about tactical uh, like map play, where you, you, you can be out of position pretty easily, and people that exploit that will, will beat you. To you'll the be, you'll like, beat you, yeah. well, they'll beat you, and you'll just be kind of like, eh, I don't, I don't I know, do anything, do I don't know what happened, yeah, right? So, exactly. so this this map is the the little bit more like, you'll understand the circumstances much more readily, um, and I think our plan right now is to launch with three at a minimum, but um, that is all relative. It really depends on what we get through. Uh, one thing we do a really we do like our best to basically build content that is scalable. Like if we make more things that are great. That will probably give you more things that are great, awesome. but we won't give you things that are not. Okay. So, great. thank you for that. Thank you. <laughs> so, are there any other play style like uh, modes? I know we played the nope. the little titans. That's just the it. Mode. That's the yep. game mode. That's yep. it. Okay. So, Get our titans to attack. The maps themselves are the thing that really changes how you play. Okay. Similar to like an ARAM where you have everybody in the middle and it it turns into a, a pretty different thing, right? If you have AOEs, you sort of win. Yes. The more AOEs, AOEs you have, the more damage, more poke you have. Um, this is kind of has a similar feeling where it's harder to be out of position in this map uh, because we funnel them in. Um, and so other maps will have more verticality, less verticality, more more areas that maybe you can and can't see from the beginning. Um, so the, the maps themselves do a really big service to really changing the way you have to play in, in the game. So Cool, 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 cool. Do you guys have a tentative release date? It's fall. Ish, uh, no official date yet. Okay. Cool. Awesome. Sweet. That's all I have to say about that. I actually really enjoyed it. It was very, very. I played twice. I played twice. I'm definitely gonna come back and play more. I played two different characters. I want to play all the characters before I can get a real good feel. Uh, Stella came in and wrecked. Yeah. Good. But yeah. Cool. But I would say like the the thing like if you play the same character a couple like there's a point. It doesn't take very long in this game because a lot of the the cool thing about the skill system is that it's 
it's sort of, <laughs> I love that I'm wearing mittens still. It's, it's Timo mitts. I'm, I'm literally like gesticulating. You can't tell that I'm not just holding my hands up. No, yeah, you're I just, I'm not like... sure. I'm not sure what to do with my hands. <laughs> I just don't know. Um, no, I, the, so the, the skill upgrades, um, rather than like an item shop or, or big trees, right? You, you make choices. And when you make choices, like you had to read those skills, right? Sit there and read and it kind of, it kind of gives you this moment of like, Oh, that was what I was supposed to do, though? Exactly. Like, oh, right click. If I do right click, you get a bonus to your left click afterwards. So I should combo, though. Like, yeah. it's sort of, we use... It's like wombo combos and stuff like that. You have to learn to figure out right. kind of what is going to work for your character right. and for you. And it, it takes time. It absolutely takes time. But but it, but the, I would say the difference, though, is that you actually, you see what that is based on us saying, hey, hey, dummy, maybe... Maybe do that one next maybe try Maybe try the left click now. Yeah. Right? And so it's pretty approachable so if you play the same character a couple times yeah you should feel very like that should be that'll be your character right yeah. like you get it you'll yeah. get it um and i think that's really it's super awesome to be able to say like you know you played once on each character if you play twice by that time you should have a pretty clear idea yeah. how you can contribute yeah. um and i think that's really strong uh in in the game itself having come from uh, like playing all the games that people will compare us to like i love them yeah but it takes so much more time for so me to get. To, I'm still wearing mittens. You can still wear those mittens. It's I okay. Wear mittens all day. <laughs> cool. Thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us yeah. about Gigantic. Super pumped for this game. Game zone.